What's the plan once you're on top of the 30-foot wall, Tim? What, what is your goal there? How are you gonna get down if the ladder's on one side? This is only 11 seconds, but there's a lot here. This is Tim Walls speaking to, I don't know, a restaurant full of people about immigration. And again, only 11 seconds, but there's a lot to unpack in that 11 seconds. So watch this. Dude, I always say this, that I just am waiting to find out how high that wall is, because then you, if it's 30 foot tall, you can go invest in the 35 foot ladder. <laughs> there's money to be made here, you know? So I'm like, <laughs> I think the first thing goes without saying, so is the guy who's trying to be the vice president of the United States advocating for profiting on people breaking into the country illegally? That's weird, right? Like, well, what is a country? A country is a, is a group of ideas defended geographically by some sort of border. Charlie says it best, when a, a border is where good ideas stop and bad ideas start. So if you look at the southern border, yeah, things south of that are not as good as they are here. Why do you think that is? Well, it's because the ideas are better. And if you're running for the vice president of the United States, one heartbeat away from the presidency, don't you think that there should be some, even just a little sense of, yeah, maybe we should protect that geographical barrier of good ideas and bad ideas. And yet the vice presidential hopeful on the Democratic ticket is here telling these people, well, well, you can make a profit sneaking people into this country. Isn't that what the cartels do? Is Tim Wall a member of the cartel? So that's that's the first part of like, yeah, maybe a guy who's wanting to be the vice president of the United States should want to protect the border and not try to figure out how to get people in illegally. That's the first part. The second part is the idea is stupid. I understand that he's probably making a joke here, but think about it just from a real world perspective. Okay, so there's a 30 foot wall. I'm gonna invest in 35 foot ladders. Great, Tim, so you're gonna invest in 35 foot ladders. You're gonna send them to Mexico so that people can jump over the wall. But even if you did that, what's the plan when you get to the top of the wall, Tim? I don't know if you know this, but if you're gonna climb over a wall, you gotta get down on the other side. Are you gonna put a ladder to one side and the other ladder to the other side? Okay, well, what about a barbed wire on top of that wall? I don't think your plan is gonna work out very well because let's just say it's one person, okay? That probably makes it more difficult, but let's just say hypothetically it's one person. This one person puts his 35 foot ladder up to the wall, climbs up to the top of it, then sits somehow patiently on the barbed wire fence to bring the ladder up and over to the other side of the wall. Because you gotta remember, somebody's gonna get up to the top of that wall with the barbed wire on top of it and look down and go, okay, well, I can either jump down 30 feet, which is not a small distance, by the way, especially height-wise. You jump down 30 feet, you're gonna break a leg at bare minimum. Hopefully, you don't die doing it. But okay, so here's the plan. I'm gonna put this ladder up against the wall, get up there and go, oh crap. So the second option, I guess, is you come with more people and you have multiple ladders. But even still, you have to get the ladder over the top of the barbed wire, which again, maybe some people can do, but the point being is you want to be able to deter people from having to do that. I think the vast majority of people who are just walking across the border, which is completely porous, as you all well know, aren't going to be willing to climb up and down 30 feet and traverse a barbed wire top of the 30 foot wall. They just won't do that. So aside from the fact that you've got a person who wants to be the vice president who is actively saying, well, I can figure out how to get, get around this. Great, dude, does that mean you want to? And two, I don't know, think of a better idea. There's probably, if you're gonna build, a, if you're gonna say, hey, people can use ladders, I think that's a little bit of a stretch to assume that all of the people coming across that aren't young, agile males are going to be totally, well, that's, look at how easy this is. Yeah, tell that to the middle-aged mother who's got her kids. Oh, yeah, 
climb up this 30-foot wall, traverse the barbed wire fence, and then jump down to the other side. <laughs> that's going to deter quite a few people. And maybe, maybe that's the point. Huh.